What's up, weirdos? We're back in subsistence, and it is the final day of October, so we have to make sure that we get as much stuff done as we can today, because uh, I think uh, I think we might have to worry about winter setting in here pretty soon, which means colder temperatures, and uh, yeah, we're going to be in trouble then. Uh, we don't have the winter jacket yet. I'm still working on it. Um, I don't know. I don't know how long it's going to take us to get that because uh, we do have the cotton growing right now. Uh, it's going to take us some time, though, as you can see. <laughs> it just started growing, so uh, it's it's going to be a while. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and throw this stuff in here. There we go. We're all set to go. Um, yeah, we're going to keep the long sleeve shirt on us. That's probably a good idea. We got one cotton here. We're going to need four more. Uh, to make that winter jacket. Plus, we haven't made those heavy pants yet, so still still need to do that. I fixed up my shotgun. It was in pretty bad shape, so we went ahead and did that. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and head on out. My goal today is uh, maybe get a little bit more kelp. And uh, maybe find some cotton. Maybe we get lucky we see some cotton while we're out today. That would be very nice. And uh, we're also going to have to do some more hunting, too, because uh, we are getting pretty low on food. I want that fridge completely stocked. I think that's probably a good idea. So, yeah, you see the uh, the wolf over here? We're going to pay this wolf a visit. All right, you know what? He's going to come right over to us. Perfect. All right, so we're just going to shoot him. Boom. All right. And uh, we'll go ahead and butcher him up. There we go. A little bit more meat. I'll wash off my hands. And uh, bears apparently go into hibernation. That makes sense. So uh, I don't know. We're probably not going to see any bears for a while. I don't know if they disappear in November or if, or if it's December. But uh, it's coming, so that's actually kind of nice because uh, the bears—they're really—they're really annoying, in my opinion. Uh, they take a lot to kill, and uh, the black bears really don't give you a lot of meat. The brown bears—they will give you some meat, but uh, I, I feel like—I feel like it'd be better to not have them around. Makes things a little bit easier. I don't mind the wolves. All right, so we're gonna come down to our fish trap, check on that, see how that's doing. Got another crate over here. Ooh, two crates over here. Perfect. Looks like some scrap as well. Okay. Now I looked on the map. There is a rogue, um, a rogue camp over by Kelp Bay. So we're not going to go over that way today. I am going to try to get this bunny over here. Ho ho ho, got him. There we go, some more fibers, or not fibers, but cloth. I got a wolf over here, I'm going to take him out. Might as well. Go level 3. I think my gun will take take out the wolf, I'm not sure. I don't want to, oh, broken arrow. Yeah, I don't want to gamble. Let's uh, do that. I know if we upgrade our shotgun, we can definitely take out all the wolves without much trouble. Alright, there we go, some more meat. I want to grab this crate. Thought there was something on the ground there. And we're going to check our fish trap in just a minute. I'm just going to do a quick scout around this area for crates. Also hit up the grub tree. There's some fibers right there. Again, rogues over by Kelp Bay. They're in the uh, that rocky section over there, those cliffs. So I think I want to go the other way around. I want to go that way, in that direction. And uh, we will have to look out for hunters because sometimes they go down to the go down to the water and do some fishing. There's a berry down here. I want to grab that. We're definitely kind of close to those hunters. They're right over on those rocks, so let's try to avoid them if we can. There's some more fibers over here. Oh, there's a bear. Where's the bear at? He's right there. All right, we'll keep moving. I see some scrap up here. Let's see if that bear stopped. 
I think he stopped. Yeah, he stopped. Okay. All right, let's uh, come over here, wash our hands off. And there is some fish in there, so we'll go ahead and grab him. There we go. Uh, some rotten meat. Perfect. I need that. I'm going to fill that all the way up, and then we're going to go ahead and harvest the oil. All right, excellent. And I'm going to take a quick little swim over here, just in case there might be some kelp. I think I see one on that rock over there. Now, the rotten meat is going to come in pretty handy. We're going to need those to make um, hand warmers or heat packs. We're going to need those in the winter for sure. And we don't have a whole lot of rotten uh, rotten meat, so I think you need like four for a heat pack. We only have four at, at our base right now, so we're going to need to uh, look out for lots of rabbits and chickens and stuff. Maybe kill a few extra than we normally do. Okay, let's come down this way. Got to look out for hunters. They might be coming down here to fish. Uh, no more kelp over here. I do see some sandstone. I do want to grab the sandstone because I am going to need that for making a greenhouse. Let's, um, let's go ahead and grab the pickaxe. There we go. Come down here. And break this up. Okay. And I think I saw a pearl over here too. Yeah, right here. And grab that as well. Excellent. All right. Take a little swim over here. There's another sandstone. Rule of thumb in this game is grab everything you possibly can. Because you never know when you're not going to have any available. Alright, I'm not... Oh, I see some more kelp over here. I'm going to grab that too. Yeah, I, I'm not sure when the lake freezes. I think it's December. The lakes will all freeze and then you won't be able to get into the water anymore. You'll have to break the ice. And I don't really want to do that. And dive down and then come back up for air. <laughs> We're probably going to get really cold doing that too, so... I want to do all of my underwater stuff now before uh, before we can't get underwater anymore. All right, I'm 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 looking back for hunters in case you guys are wondering. That's why I keep looking over. All right, more kelp, perfect. So I think that's about five or six kelp. That's pretty good right there. Yeah, five. I'm actually gonna eat a berry. We got an onion here and an apple. All right, let's put that up there. I'm going to eat another kelp. Uh, you can see our our hunger is going down pretty quick. Maybe it's because we're a little cold. It's not that cold out, though. It's 11C right now. That's tolerable. Maybe it's because we're wet. That could be it. Another dive over here. Not seeing any kelp over here. Yeah. Not really seeing anything. So what we're going to do is we're going to come back over here to the beach. And I want to take a nice walk around the lake. Now, maybe we, we don't get the whole way around. Maybe we only get halfway and then come back. That can be useful too because a lot of the times stuff will spawn behind you. So we'll walk halfway up this beach and then maybe back around. I'm going to look out for hunters. We're also looking for uh, crates, maybe a lock crate, that'd be nice. I can't go too far because you can see protein is really starting to go down. That, I'm surprised by that. Yeah, that's, that's shocking how fast that's going down. So maybe we just go down here to the end where it starts to turn. We're also going to be looking out for hunters. If we open up the map, you can see we, we've actually looked in a... Quite a bit of area over here. Oh, I see the fortress base. You know what? That's the fortress base up there. That really big base. It's right up there. I think that's it. I'm not sure. I kind of want to go up and take a look. We also have uh, a wolf over here. Either hey Mr. Wolf. 
You want to be lunch? Oh, I think he wants to be lunch. Yep. All right. Let's go ahead and butcher up the wolf. Get some more food. All right, and a little bit more cloth too. I like that. Get the gun back out. This is an area where you might run into hunters. At least for us. And now, the nice thing is that that all depends on your game. Because uh, hunters will spawn in. You can turn the hunters off if you want. But they will spawn in depending on where your base is. And depending on where you place your BCU. we got a bear over here. But I think he's going to let us go if we come up here. Oh, there's some iron or, or something like that. I think, it was, I think it's iron. It might be potassium. I want to grab these crates, though. I don't think there's any rogues over here. I hope there's no rogues. Because otherwise, we're going to be in trouble. There's a lot of crates. That, that's why I get a little worried whenever I see lots of crates all together. That usually means there's rogues nearby. I didn't see any over here, though, whenever I looked on the map. Alright, and that bear is going to stand over by that crate, so I don't think we'll be able to get that. Let's see, what is this? I think this is... I think this is potassium. Yep. All right, we'll take it though. All right, and can I get this medicinal here without you getting all grumpy? Um, yeah, I think we're okay. I'll take a wide berth around this bear. I want to get this crate if I can. Yeah, he's just gonna stand on top of that one. You see him sniffing it? Yeah, he, he wants what's, whatever's in it. Maybe there's some berries or something in there. There's a lot of crates over here, guys. I'm glad we came over here. Definitely have to look out for hunters, though. Hunters, rogues, bears. <laughs> this game is very scary. You never know what you're going to get. It looks like we might be getting some rain here pretty soon. It's getting pretty cloudy. So we may have to swim back. I, I really don't want to uh, go back on land when I can't really hear animals. I see something else over here. Looks like another crate. I don't think it's a lock crate. Oh, oh. There's a wolf right there. Is he coming over here? No, he's just going to stand there. That's fine. Get up here and get this crate. Alright, more nails. Another bandage. Now, is this an area we've been to? No. Let's see if we can open this up a little bit. I think this is the edge of the map right up here. Yep, this is the edge of the map. So, not much over this way. I'm not really seeing any crates. See some medicinals. What's that? That's just a plant over there. How are we doing on time? It's about it's about midday. So we're doing okay. There's that bear down there. So he's gonna leave us alone. Let's see if there's any ore on this rock. A lot of these rocks are gonna have multiple ore on them. You just got to find the right one. This one doesn't have anything, though. All right. So, bear right there. We've got a wolf over here. I'm going to take my chances with the wolf. What level are you? Level three? Yeah, we can, we can get some more meat. He was actually walking away, wasn't he? Right, here it comes. All right. Butcher you up. And we're probably getting pretty full now. Yeah, we're definitely filling up here. Hit up another grub tree while we're at it. And there's a bear down there in the direction I wanted to go. Let's walk up here real quick. I know, I've got to wash off my hands. I'm going to do that when we get down to the water. It's actually a, a river over here, so we can wash off over here, too. There's another wolf. Man. I kind of want to get that wolf. Food is really important right now. Yeah, let's get him. 
Come into the water. Come and play. There's also a moose over there. Hey. Hey. You know, it's not that cold. It, it, it's, it's fairly warm water. Come on. Come on, Wolfie Wolf. Come here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> he couldn't see us. He was, he was stuck in the bush, it looked like. All right. Butcher. All right. Look at that. That's what I like to see. All right. Perfect. All right. And we also got a chicken here. I kind of want to get that chicken for its, uh, for its meat. I'm going to make some rotten meat. Stay right there. Got him. All right. Grab you. I might go after that moose, but I think I'm going to skip that just because I don't have a splint on me. I always like to have a splint if I'm going to hunt the moose. Because I know the chances of me getting my leg broken are pretty high. Alright, this is usually a pretty good area for lock crates. We do have a lock pick on us. If we find a lock crate, we might have to give up some stuff. Sometimes you got to give up things to get things. And uh, that might be what we have to do. Throw away some stuff we don't need. We can probably eat these berries. There we go. It looks like, uh, oh yeah, we we, ha we got that rot that rotten meat from uh, from the fish trap. Get the shotgun back out. Got another rabbit here. Um, yeah, I got space for you. I can stack that. Okay. Sorry, bunny. I'm going to butcher you up. All right, I'm going to look around for crates. Not seeing anything. Oh, there's a lock crate. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, we got a lock crate. All right, look around in case there's a wolf. I thought I heard a growl, but maybe not. All right, so there's probably going to be some stuff in here that we're... Well, we'll probably have to take s some stuff and leave some stuff behind. Uh, definitely take that. Protein bars, definitely take that. We need those. All right, this stuff will stack good. A lot of this stuff is stacking. All right, that won't stack. Um... All right, I I don't need the wait these I can turn into cordage. Let's do that, and then we got one we can get rid of that. Take those, and then this ammo man I like to have that. Um oh, I can butcher you up. Okay, and then what else can I get rid of? Oh man, um. I don't need that medicinal seed. And I don't really need those tomato seeds either. I'd much rather have the ammo. So there you go. We are completely full now. Completely full. I don't know what this is. is if this is iron, I don't think we can take it. Probably not. If it's potassium, we could probably take it. That looks like iron. Oh, man. I think I'd rather have iron than potassium, to be honest. You know, we can get rid of those feathers. Let's do that. Get rid of the feathers. I don't need the feathers. Yeah, I like having a little bit of iron. Alright, so I think what we'll do is start heading back. There's another chicken there, but I... Actually, I do have space for the chicken. But he's going to run right to that wolf. Could take down the wolf. I got space for that. We can just stack the meat. And I don't have space for the fibers. That's right. Alright, well... Um, yeah, let's go ahead and... Uh, let's go ahead and shoot the wolf. Come here! Come here. I don't have all day. There we go. Alright. And now... Butcher up. And the box is just going to fly out of him. Probably. Nope. No, that stuff's, that stuff's stacked. Perfect. Alright. Back down to the water. Rinse off. And I think our best bet now is to probably swim back. I'll take another look around here. Maybe we find a few more things we can grab. The chicken, I I can take the chicken. I can take his meat. Can't take the feathers, though. I have to drop something, probably. Yeah. Um, oh, no! Hey, you come back here! 
<laughs> oh, you stupid chicken. I have to waste two arrows on the stupid chicken. Where'd you go? Alright. Let's see, what do I want to give up here? Just got to give it up for a second. Uh, let's give up the kelp for a second. Alright, take the chicken. Butcher. There we go, we'll leave the feathers and we'll take the kelp back. Alright, there we go. Some wonderful inventory management for you guys. <laughs> and we got some more iron right here. Look at that. I will definitely take that. Alrighty. Well, today has been a good loot day, I must say. I've been quite happy with today. Uh, we're going to go ahead and swim back over. Let's see, is there anything else here I can grab? Any berries or anything? I don't think I have space for it. Nah, let's just swim back. Let's just take a little swim. I do have space for kelp, I think. So if I see any kelp on the way back, we'll grab some of that. Because we won't be able to get any more kelp here in another few days. I have it set to uh, four days per month. So I think, uh, I think November starts tomorrow. And then we have another four days. And then I believe everything will be frozen at that point. And we won't be able to get underwater anymore. So, that's going to be my goal, is die for kelp pretty much every day, if I can. Alright, so we've got another wolf over there. We might be able to stack some more meat. Yeah, I might do that. Any more kelp over here? Doesn't look like it. There's some more sandstone, though. Yeah, I, th I think I want to get that sandstone. Although that wolf is kind of close to the water. Oh, he is pretty close. Let's see if we can get this without... Oh, are you coming over here? I'll just try to get this. Oh, this is dangerous, guys. I get the kelp too. Yep. Okay. Oh. Let's get up here. I'm gonna get the wolf. Might as well. He's a level two. Come here. Rawr. All right. There we go. Butcher. And that should all stack, right? Yep, perfect. All right, wash our hands and let's head back. It has been a very good day. I must say, this has been a quite a good day for us. And we've avoided hunters, we've avoided rogues. If we see any more uh, crates on the way back, we'll definitely grab them. I see some berries there, but again, I don't really have any space at this point. I kind of just want to get this stuff back so it, m m none of my meat goes bad. Although, it doesn't matter if it does because we do need that rotten meat. I'll grab some more iron. This is actually potassium. Alright. There we go. Good stuff. Heard another chicken. Um, I don't re really don't want to mess with another chicken, to be honest. It's just too much work dropping stuff and picking it up again. All right, more nails there. How many did we get today? 28. Not great. 28's uh, a little down from uh, what we normally get. I see some more iron right here. Get that. All right, perfect. Another building crate. Should have plenty of nails here. Oh, no nails, but elect electronic parts. And uh, the uh, scrap metal, those were both really good. Alrighty. Well, there we go. Pretty good day. Take a look around here. We don't have any visitors, so that's good. Well, let's head inside and 
We'll go ahead and cook some stuff up because I am getting pretty hungry, so let's do that. And uh, we'll throw some food in here. Uh, look at that. Wow, that's a lot of steaks right there, guys. We're doing pretty good. Uh, decent amount of liver. Got some more chicken. I'm going to cook up. Actually, you know what? Yeah, yeah we're going to cook up some chicken right now. I think that's a good plan. Um, oh, you know what? i got to put this stuff in here. All right, throw that in there. Fill this up. Okay, and then grab those. Cook those up. We'll throw the rabbits in here for now. We got fish still. We got uh, a pork chop from a long time ago. We've got this uh, rack of ribs from the moose from a while ago. So we got quite a bit of stuff here. I'm, I'm liking what we've got so far. Uh, we can throw the rotten meat in here. There we go. And uh, let's see. Kelp can go in here. I can probably eat. I'm going to go ahead and eat this apple. I'll throw the onion in there. Okay, copper ingots. I'm going to go ahead and start getting some iron going. Yeah, let's just put the whole stack in there. All right. Uh, put the gun away so I don't accidentally shoot it off. And uh, that goes in there. Okay, and then this stuff can go in here. Alloy sheets can go in here. I got We're up to 17 alloy sheets. Wow. All right, we'll go ahead and eat all these. And we're probably going to need a little bit more, I think. Yeah, maybe one more. Um, let's eat a rabbit. There we go. Now we're feeling pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and take a little drink. Excellent. We'll grab this water as well. We'll throw the rest of the stuff in here. I really need to upgrade this refiner. I think that's something I want to do here pretty soon. Um, and then this stuff. All right, we got... Wow. We're doing really good on nails. I got so many nails, I don't know what to do with them all. Um, <laughs> we're over, we're over uh, 400 nails at this point. That's great. Uh, we got eight more protein bars. We're up to 32. That's awesome. All right, and then throw all this stuff in here. Up to 50 cloth. Cool. I'm gonna grab some more arrows while we're at it. And I don't need all this pistol ammo on me. Let's throw a bunch of that in here. Okay, um, we could make some more shotgun. Yeah, I think I want to make some more shotgun shells. Probably a good idea. Um, there we go. There we go. Let's uh, let's make five. And before I forget, let's cook up the rest of the chicken. And. Um, and we'll throw a couple of those in there. I like to keep these on me, so whenever I go down to the fish trap, I can easily just toss them into the trap. Okay, and the cotton is coming along. We need a little bit of water in there. Let's fill it all the way up. And we're also going to need some fertilizer. I don't think I have any potassium right now. No, no potassium. Um, powdered potassium, or whatever you want to call it. We have to send that through the refiner. All right, so that's filled up. That is about 25% there. So I would say that's going to take another three days. And then we'll have the cotton, then we can get our jacket. We still need to upgrade our pants. They're still uh, yeah, they're kind of uh, kind of light. We need some heavier pants for sure. Um, now that's going to take some uh, and take a lot of uh, cotton, I think. We're, we're yeah, we're going to need four padded cloth. So, to make padded cloth, we need three cotton each. So, we're going to need 12 more cotton just for the pants. So, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen before winter. Um, that's definitely definitely, gonna, definitely not going to happen. <laughs> uh, we could probably go out and fill up our water before it gets too late. Yeah, let's do that. Ooh, it's getting dark out. It is getting dark out. It's getting cold, too. Alright, go ahead and fill up. Thankfully, there's no animals around us, so maybe we'll take advantage of that and hit up the tree. Get ourselves some more wood and another grub. I do want to do some more building, so maybe we'll do that. And I want to get some more walls up. 
And if we can, I'd like to get a greenhouse on this thing. It would be nice. I don't know if it's going to happen, though. Probably not going to happen before the winter. Going to have to wait on that. Alright, uh, so we'll throw those in there. We can throw one of these in here. Okay, and do I have any walls on me? i got a platform here. I don't have any walls, but we can easily make some. Let's grab some of these. Okay, I'm going to make... How many walls do I want? I want one. Yeah, at least one, two, three, four. If I can make four, that'd be good. Yeah, I don't have enough wood. That's fine. We've uh, we got logs here. There we go. We'll craft a bunch of logs with that. And uh, let's craft a few more. There we go. Perfect. All right. So what I'm going to do is place these. So we'll bring those down there. You know what? It would be helpful if I had some light. There we go. I can actually see what I'm doing. All right. So, yeah, I kind of want to block this off right here. So we'll do that. I think what I'm going to do is put another platform right here, or a ceiling, and then block, or basically extend this porch out a little bit further, because this is kind of goofy right here. Yeah, we'll definitely do that. There's a storm coming in. Alright, and then another one of you, so we'll, for now we'll put you right here, but I'm going to switch this up probably, uh, probably pretty soon. Okay, got another one coming. And we'll put this over here. And that's it, I think. Is that it? That's it. Alright. Well, that is good. We'll let these craft up. I need one more, I think, to make another wall. Yeah, there we go. We'll get that going. Uh, so I think we'll leave the video there. Next video is going to be November, I believe. So uh, it's going to be interesting to see what happens. I think we'll probably get some snow or something like that. That usually happens uh, once you get in November. And look at that. We've got some rogues. we got some rogues down by our fish trap. Ooh, okay. Well, we got to be careful whenever we go down there tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, let's keep that in mind. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with how this is coming along. I'm going to need to get some ceilings on this, too. Maybe we'll get that going as well next video. I'm gonna gonna have to huddle here by the fire to keep warm because uh, it is getting pretty cold. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Share it with your friends. Subscribe to get more videos, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.